Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we are doing something really fun, or what I think is going to be really fun. In this video, as you can probably tell by the title, we are doing another Boyfriend Picks Our Outfits, but this time it'll be fall edition. And to put a little twist on it, we're making them very specific fall outfits. For the first one, we are going to be doing a nice like cozy outfit that you're just like drinking cider in, lounging at home, or going out to pick out a pumpkin spice latte, stuff like that. The second one is more of a, like an outing, like going to the pumpkin patch, going the apple picking, I don't know. Third and final outfit will be a date night to a haunted hayride. <laughs> I'm very excited, fall is my favorite season, so I'm very interested to see what these boys are going to choose. Okay, let's get into the video. First up, we have Cozy, I'm making a cider at home or running to pick up a PSL fit. Let's start there. I kind of already forgot what the first one. What's the first one again? Cozy, casual, nothing crazy at home. Like. I don't know what she's got here. Oh, she loves this, but that's, yeah, this is cozy, cozy, Tyler Posey. We're gonna go with this emo night hoodie before you liked EDM, you liked emo. That'll be that, because she wears this when she's staying home. And pair this with the Emo Night Splatter Sweatpants. Fit number one, staying at home and making a cup of hot cider. This is like the collegiate, you know, clickbait. This is very cozy, on the couch vibes. And it's like folly and red. I think this is, yeah, this is the one. That's the first one. We need sweats though. Oh yeah. I don't want to be too basic, you know, and just be like, oh, just the crew neck and sweats. But like, it's honestly, that's what I would do if it was like fall. I feel like this is, I mean, it's kind of basic, but we're supposed to be home and like cozy and, and cute. So just the little fall warm sweater and some sweats, because if you want to be on the couch and cozy and fall, it seems like the vibe. This is the first outfit. This is like making some cider at home, honestly. I've basically been living in these outfits for like the past month, so that's good. But I just feel like this was maybe a shameless promo for Emo Night, but we'll see. Um, I need to get my Crocs on. I love this outfit, it's so comfortable and it's definitely what I would wear. This is what I'm wearing. There you go, cozy chic. I would say for the first one, this is like a solid 10 out of 10, like what I wear every day. But did you do this to plug your merch? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, I thought so. Well, it's great merch and I wear it without you having to tell me to, so. Yeah. It's a good job. You're welcome. <laughs> You're, You're welcome. <laughs> Outfit number two. This is the obvious. You know, like, like cozy <laughs> on the couch, <laughs> yeah. watching Hocus Pocus. This is the crucial part. It's a little autumn tone, you know, the red, so oh, yeah. we tied it in there. So we're just gonna start with that. Very fall. I feel like I've just worn this all of quarantine, so I'm just kinda used to it, so I'm not that like thrilled by it, but it is exactly what we asked. You gotta like get on the couch though for the full effect. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have my pumpkin spice latte. How do I look? You look cozy. This will really add to it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It's and funny because like in any other video normal times, I'd be like, great outfit, but like, I feel like this is just everything I've been wearing, so I'm just like, get me out of it! <laughs> what else? What else for the girl? Oh, we just went to the apple orchard. Should I just pick out the outfit that she already wore? This is a cozy guy. I feel like the, she has more clothes that aren't in here. Day at the orchard. Maybe we'll go with a Sherpa moment. What does she wear with the Sherpa? That looks cute. This, maybe? I think this will be cute. This with some boots. Ooh, the cowboy boots. That'll be chic. Yes. When you're tromping through the orchards, you gotta have cowboy boots, right? Cute. Not really the direction that I was going. But I know she loves those boots, so we'll do that. Okay, you're going out on the town. This is cute. Warm, little autumn, you know. We got a layer though. Definitely gonna layer. Wow. Might be like a little too much like brown with the yellow, but that's kind of cute. And the cutoff? Oh! Maybe? Or maybe it's just like <laughs> vomit. I don't know, we'll see. I need pants, but I don't know. Ooh, actually, 
actually. Ooh, oh my god, okay, this is perfect. This is like this light green kind of foresty thing with the browns and the yellow, the little mustard yellow. Mm. Okay, docks have been found. Throw them right there, keep it super urban, outfitters, campy. I want to thank the sponsor of today's video, Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community that has thousands of classes that help you explore new skills or deepen passions that you already have, like drawing. Most of the classes are under 60 minutes, and each class is a combination of video lessons and a class project. And whether you're interested in photography, film, videography, graphic design, writing, you name it, there are so many different classes to choose from, and what's great is that they're all different skill levels, so you can really learn at your own pace. So we'll sometimes get comments about how we make our videos, what editing software and we found a really cool class called Filmmaking from home taught by Penny Lane. So if you're interested in filming or YouTube or vlogs, it seems really interesting. They teach editing and filming. So if you're looking for a place to start, that's a great option. I love Skillshare because it is only $10 a month. You get no ads on your videos. There's always new classes to choose from. It's really great and it's all right there at your little fingertip. The first thousand people to use the link in our description will get a free trial of the Skillshare premium membership. Thanks Skillshare! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is truly not what I was expecting. At all. I cannot wait to see. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. So the thing about this next outfit is that I love all of these pieces individually, but it's a little too farmer southern chic for me. Just nothing that I would ever wear together. But I feel like it's definitely something that like people in the south would wear to go apple picking and pumpkin picking. Uh, nothing wrong with that because everything is cute. But for me, it's just like not an outfit I'm comfortable in wearing all together. I feel like I'm about to go <laughs> line dancing. It's really cute, but I, I can't picture myself wearing this out anywhere. It's very cute though. Cute. <laughs> I look like a little southern girl. Yeah, you're going to the orchard. <laughs> so pretty. James. <laughs> I'm in Nashville. I, yeah, I'm literally like on my way to a bachelorette party in Nashville. Well, I originally wanted to pair it with your boots or your docks, but then I saw those in your closet and I know that you like them, <laughs> so I figured I would just put them there. Yeah, I look like we're going to a hoedown. <laughs> like I look like Emphasis I'm about- on the ho. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> I look like I'm about to do the hoedown throwdown. Yeah. I would say I would give this, for me, like a, like a five. <laughs> the thing is like, they're all my clothes and yeah. I like them all, but not together. Like it's, I just feel uncomfortable. Okay. But it's really cute. And I think you did a really good job. And someone named like Brayley would wear this or something. <laughs> right. Wait, this one, I'm dead. That's so cute. Yeah. I would never know to put that together, but the colors are really good for autumn. Yeah. Cute, babe. Very, like earthy and nice. Ooh. Cute, oh. babe. This is really cute. Yeah, with the brown on top too. Yeah, like, I like the frill on the bottom too. It's very Starbucks core. <laughs> Agreed. I always love wearing these pants with these shoes. because mm -hmm. They just look like... Five. And these colors are so fall, I would have never even thought to put them together. Yeah, you look very cute. I'm gonna wear it now. Yeah. But I have to change it in my third outfit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fun fact, me and Erin's first date was on a haunted hayride. She's gonna probably be really cold, so we'll do a beanie. <laughs> and we'll do this because this is the biggest Jacket? No, no, no. Let's do this fur. I think this fur would be fun. And maybe that's too... You don't want to wear this on a haunted hayride because I feel like it draws too much attention to you. And then the actors will just like end up scaring you more. So we're just going to keep it low key with this puffer. And she always gets super cold at night anyway. Ten pairs of Levi's here. I don't know the difference. Are these shorts? Yeah, no shorts. But I feel like... I would want to be cozy, so maybe we just stick with sweats. Maybe she should also wear this under her puffer so she doesn't get cold. Nice pair of gray sweats. Mm. No. We're gonna go with black sweats so that she's in pretty much all black and then she can get away from any scary people at the haunted hayride. And then shoes for that, probably just like her regular uh, hiking boots. That's what I'm gonna do. All right, like the little industrial, cause there's like these bright orange ones, but I don't think. 
These, I don't, I'd love to throw them in the mix because of, you know, the Halloween season, but I don't know. I don't know why, like, date night, I'm like, we need, like, a dress. <laughs> date on the prairie, you know what I'm saying? Oh. Dude, I'm like, do I just go completely ridiculous? Yeah, so we're just gonna go get out of control because I'm losing it right now. So this is, this is the show stop up. Fool. Faux fur, you know, some slick, shiny pants. Oh, wait, it's got cute. The little, this looks actually like it's probably kind of, kind of cute for like a date. All right, we'll do it, we'll do it like that. The loud and proud, fuzzy, fuzzy faux fur dinner vibration, you know? I don't even know how this shirt works. It's got like one sleeve, so let's get the Prada boys. And we're done. Okay, I'm, a, I'm just a little confused by this outfit, so. This is our date night on a haunted hayride, and he put me in sweatpants, <laughs> which I definitely wouldn't wear. I would for sure put jeans on, but this is cute layered for sure, with a good beanie. This is all solid up at the top. I really like the jacket. I like the fleece underneath in the beanie, because it'll probably be a little chilly, but the sweatpants are just bad. <laughs> and then, like these are cute, I guess. I do like the top part of this outfit. I just feel like the jacket's a little aggressive, especially for LA. There's no way that I would need to wear this coat, but I do like this with this. I would absolutely wear that and this over it, but maybe just not for this occasion. But I mean, he was thinking of layering. Last and final fit. I figured you would be cold on a hayride. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but in Los Angeles? Yeah, you always get cold no matter what. You wouldn't want to like lend me your jacket if I got cold? <laughs> you don't think that I would ever wear these? Here's the thing that you're gonna learn in the edit is that I picked out gray ones first, but then I was like, you know what? I'm gonna put her in all black so that she is less conspicuous to the scary people. Oh, that's really nice. And like, I didn't put you in the fur jacket like, either. Jeans? I thought you would want to be comfy. <laughs> no, that's you. <laughs> that's you. I'm thinking about going out and getting in an Uber and like meeting a date and wearing these sweatpants. Yeah. I Well, I actually didn't even realize that it was going to be a date that's not me, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, it would be you. <laughs> It'd be you. <laughs> I'd give this like a 6 out of 10. Points okay. deducted for, no, I'd give it like a 7. All right. Points deducted for like a real heavy coat and the sweats. Okay. And like maybe you also not the these. Like... I think you look awesome, so. Thank you. Now this one, I was like having a whole <laughs> tragedy because I didn't know what the fuck to do. I don't even know how these operate. <laughs> oh my God, then... wait, this is going to be really good. Oh yeah. This is a skirt. Oh, that's a skirt. <laughs> Do this. Oh yeah, cute. I mean, we're good. Look how, dude, this is this is very dark. This is like a TikTok clothing hack trick. This is banging. Look how cute with the shoes, though. The shoulders down a little bit, like let like it hang an down. Moment. Oh, 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 that looks cute. Legs are very hairy, so if you can see, don't zoom in. <laughs> I don't like this as a top. Just gonna say I'm very sorry, but I think you did a good job. That's fair. This and this is very cute. Oh, this is yeah. just like a lot. But it's fall, so like, whatever. How did it go for you? <laughs> he Mood. tried. He tried. Okay. I'm mostly just interested to watch his footage. Me too. I'm to so excited. To see the thought process. Let's exchange. Send me your first outfit. The comfy, like, at okay. home one. This one is like classic me. I was oh, cute. Backwards. Oh, well, you can't even tell. Oh, that's cute. I really like how he, you know, all the colors go together. Because he really could have gone, yeah. like, a number of different ways with this. <laughs> but he was very neutral and, like, oh, I'll match the top to the shoes. Yeah, it know. looks very fall. All right. Okay, I'll send you mine. You got. Yeah, I'll send you mine. Again, I feel like it doesn't really get fun until, like, the next two. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. He was, oh, like, very great. collegiate. It's, like, fall colors. <laughs> Oh, I think TJ literally probably just picked out. Well, I was wearing emo night stuff, so I was like, okay, he obviously did this like plug emo night. I feel like we look very much like ourselves. Yeah, especially now. I was like, I don't feel any different because I just wear this stuff every day right now, anyways. So Same. like, I don't feel any different. What was the next one? The next one was oh, like You're a day out. Yep, to going to a pumpkin patch or an apple orchard. Apple picking. This one is just <laughs> just picture me like picking you up 
to go to this and this is what I have on. <laughs> In your dreams, TJ. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, that's a really cute photo though. Like the sun is coming it? in, it really matches the oh, orange thanks. of the pumpkin behind you. <laughs> this is gonna be like folklore vibes. Yeah, I literally was like, if we lived in Nashville or Texas and I was going pumpkin picking. <laughs> it's a really cute outfit if I, I wasn't doing it in Los Angeles. Like I would never yeah. wear this in LA. I would probably actually wear this for sure. Oh. I don't know if I would have thought of putting that together like that, but I mean, it's cute. Yeah, I feel like you've definitely worn this, but like minus the jacket. You would for sure wear this. I can picture I like picking you up, getting in the Tesla, I going mean, to always. David's. Imagine if the two of us showed up in these outfits, pumpkin picking, people would be like, <laughs> who are they? Like, I look like I would, I'm like your babysitter. <laughs> <laughs> this one was very interesting. Date night, going on a hayride. That's the exact definition I said. And this, and this, <laughs> this is what he This chose. is what I was given. See, this he should have chose for the second one. Yeah. Like this is good for the second one. I like mean, I'm it's wearing so cute. hiking boots. He gave me hiking <laughs> boots <laughs> and sweatpants. I'm like, well, maybe I'll have to hike up to the hayride. I don't know. <laughs> and have we ever been on a date where I was wearing sweatpants? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe he forgot your style because quarantine has been so long. I know, literally. And then I'm wearing, this jacket is a literal winter coat. And I was like, <laughs> yeah, it is. babe, like when would I, we're not, I'm not gonna wear a winter coat. But then he's like, but you get cold. And I was like, okay. I had to be like, I didn't get shoes for this. And he's like, you're hiking boots. You're like, are you like, sure? For oh the third God. one? Oh God. Yeah. Hiking boots, are you sure? I wouldn't really say this really followed suit with a the theme, but I mean, it no. is fall. So, well, it's sort of winter, yeah. I guess too, but. It's like pretty wintry. Oh, cute. Okay, but if you it's, really zoom in, the top is a skirt. You look like you should be in Scream Queens. <laughs> <laughs> I know, you're right. Love the jacket. Yeah, um, again, yeah. not too hot. I know, what are these men thinking? I, I do, <laughs> it's, it's the shoes with it too. Black on black on black. They're like so fancy and I'm wearing fucking khaki boots <laughs> I and <know>. sweats. <laughs> I'd say they both really excelled at the first one. Nolan definitely did better at the second one than TJ did. <laughs> the last two are just tragic for the cause. Yeah, Neither I of us like are showing up to a hayride wearing these helmets. Absolutely not. Well guys, let us know if you guys want to see more of these. I think they're fun. I have a good time. Me you know, too. if you have any other scenarios or types of outfits, let us know. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you on see Sunday. you on Friday. Friday. <laughs> <I said> Friday. Sunday. <laughs> Whenever or, we don't know. And also Sunday. Sometimes it is Sunday when we post. <laughs> okay. Bye. Bye. Bye.